And for this necklace, it's made up of a special special shells. And for these special shells, uh, it's only found in Papua New Guinea. And the provinces will be for West New Britain and East New Britain. So this one, it's a shell money or a traditional currency for West New Britain province and Kimbe is the town and this one is shell money which they call it tabu for East New Britain and East New Britain is, is found in Rabaul the town is Rabaul and they for these two provinces they use it it's a special uh, traditional currency that they use it for special events mainly customary obligations like bride price or when there's a death in the family then they have to share this with everyone who come share the shell money so this actually this one the, the, the brown and the black ones is for West New Britain and this one like the brownish uh, yeah brown and white is for East New Britain and they all collected from the, the sea and it's a special one for the two provinces. So mainly it's more valued and for customer obligations to do with bride price or if we are trying to settle disputes and all this for two uh, villages or clans, they have to use this as a way of respect. And it's commonly used still in, 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 in West New Britain and East New Britain because that's the traditional currency and they do it for other things like for East New Britain they can do this, they can, if family doesn't have uh, uh, money to pay for school fees, they can always go to the bank and exchange the shell money and get uh, exchange for money and then they can pay school fee. And for West New Britain, it's highly used for traditional customary obligations. Yeah, so that's it and it's more value, but it's a, it's a, People are creative in West New Britain to come up with this and you can wear it as a necklace and it can look nice on you when you wear it. And tourists or whoever a foreigner comes over to visit and all this and when a Papua New Guinea give you this one, it's from the heart, they're giving it to you. And it's a memory for you or a souvenir for you to take back to your country. Great price is, uh, there's a two part to it. If a guy is interested in the lady or they have been uh, having a relationship for some time and then they want to expose the relationship to everyone, the guy need to bring, uh, need to bring some shell money across to the bride's uh, family and the bride as uh, the parents or the aunties, they have to share the, the shell money with all the cousin brothers and all the brothers as a way of respect and also for them to see uh, to respect the, the groom coming along with the, the bride. And then the next, the next one, if they're prepared now, then the next stage is for them to, the, the guy have to prepare shell monies again, and they have to bring it over to the, the lady's side for an exchange of the lady, as well as some food and some household things that the lady gonna take over to, to start off the new family. So it's it's valued still in our in our provinces near Britain. Yeah, and it's actually a hard work to prepare all this, but it worth something. Let us see.